Hey guys, it's KG48, and welcome back to my Minecraft multiplayer server Let's Play. This is Season 12, Feed the Beast. We're playing the Direwolf 20 pack, and this is Part 27. And we're here with Menticore. Hello. And Mordecai. Hello. And Bemmer60, I don't know if he's on TeamSpeak. Yeah, it's Beaner. Come on, uh, There he is. And, uh, yeah, uh, gonna be making some videos today. I, I didn't have plans to make videos today, but... But the fact of the matter is, I got I want to do some stuff on the server, and I've been doing too much in between videos, and uh, from now on, when I'm doing stuff, I'm going to try and show as much as I can. So, um, yeah, you got the setup here. I think you saw this yesterday. I'm pretty sure I haven't added anything to it. Uh -huh. um, and then down here, we have nothing new, except I started adding charcoal back to the boiler, and it's going fine. Uh, we've got power again. Uh, the middle one isn't running yet, but the middle one was only for EU, and I don't really need the EU right now. So I don't have any plans to get that one up right now. But over here, I have the makings of a liquid boiler thing. I don't even know what to call it. Uh, that's going to run off the uh, the biofuel. I don't know if I have enough biofuel to keep it going, but I'm going to try, and uh, I've got about 40,000 saplings, so if... if Oh, never mind. I've got 75,000 saplings. So if worse comes to worse and it's not enough, what I'll do is I'll just make the tank bigger, save up a bunch more, and then set it up again. Uh, I've also got 27,000 charcoal, and that's after setting up the this boiler. So the charcoal is just coming in like crazy, uh, which is really nice. Uh, let's see what else we got here. Uh, we've got 5,000 coal coke, 5,000 UU matter, uh, 10,000 iron, uh, 11,000 rubber, uh, it's looking pretty good. It's looking pretty good. But believe it or not, this stuff can go pretty fast, some of it. But, uh, yeah, we're doing good right now. So, right now I need to make some aqueous accumulators, so I'm going to go do that. So, uh, let's see what Mordecai is working on. What are you working on, Mordecai? There we go. Going down to my second boiler room. Any big projects on the horizon? You are making solar panels, or are you done with that? Solar panels. They're going to put up these three more boilers. Uh, what do you need a uh, power for? Because I want it. But are, do you need it or? No. <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> Bear back. Making me choke on my laughter. <laughs> I want one billion MJ per tick. I'm not gonna I rest. Want, I just want to see how far I can push this thieves cart farm. So, I'm thinking the Steve's cart, one Steve cart, can hold four boilers. Uh, Depends how big you make it. Two, yeah, big two, track. Well, uh, we've made our tree farms about as big as you can make them, because uh, they can only get so much wood. Uh, the only thing I was thinking we could probably do on our tree farms, we could probably make them a little bit bigger, um, and then put an extra um, cargo whole dump. What are they called? Cargo manager? Yeah. yeah. Put a cargo manager on the opposite end because basically what's going to happen and I think mine is actually doing it. I think he's filling up with wood and probably losing some of the wood uh, just because the tree farm's so big. Yeah. I wish there was a way to just let him pick up saplings. It would be oh, so nice. Also if, you look, also, if you look at your tree farm and there's trees growing, if you see a bunch of trees, more than 10, then it doesn't make any sense to make it any bigger because he's not keeping up with it anyway. Sorry, go ahead, whoever's trying to talk. Why don't you have a second cart running the track, then? Because they'll bump into each other. Um, we could set up in a separate track, but... I mean, Nutjob Mordecai might do that, but I don't really have any reason for that. Uh, hey, 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 hey. <laughs> but, but the thing is, the reason you can keep up four boilers off one track is because you're going to use the saplings. Uh, the saplings can keep up two boilers, and uh, you're going to use the charcoal, which can keep up two boilers. So, you might be able to even keep up five, maybe. If you played your cards right, but I don't, I don't think I'll ever need more than four boilers. I think I might even scrap the the IC2 boilers and just make them into MJ as well, because now your solar panels, yeah, yeah, one solar panel is equals one boiler. Yeah, I don't, I don't think those <laughs> those turbines are that great. I mean, yeah, if you look at everything, see the thing is, uh, solar panels take a ton of iron and rubber um that's kind of a that's kind of a problem it's a lot easier to just get the steel believe it or not um so uh yeah so but i'm not thrilled with those turbines i kind of feel like uh, uh mordecai's gonna actually make me some golems uh when he gets around to it no pressure i'm just 
just talking about it for the video. I'm mm -hmm. not I'm not trying to remind you. Um, but he's going to make me some golems. And, and basically what I was going to do is I was going to have a delivery system for EU anywhere on the server um, with zero energy loss. And the way you do this is um, you basically have an, M an MFSU and you have Lapatron crystals and you have a delivery system that puts the Lapatron crystals into the MFSU, waits till it's charged, and then another, another system pulls it out. The problem with that is in order to do it, you need... You need uh, red power machines. Um, you need a retriever because, um, in order to get, in order to get an MFSU to charge a Lapatron crystal, it's got to be on the bottom of the MFSU. Let me see if I have one in the area. I do. Okay. So if you were going to get a Lapatron crystal in here to be charged, it would have to be in the bottom. And the only way to get it in the bottom is from the bottom of the machine, um, which is fine. You could put the Lapatron crystal in there, but you can't take it out um, because the things pushing it in there from the bottom. Um, th so you would need a retriever. A retriever can pull something out from a distance, so you don't have to have it right up against the machine to pull the full Lapatron crystal out of the bottom. The problem with that is the the, the retriever needs um, sunlight to operate. It needs, although you could probably, I think there's a way to get um, thermal. thermal. Yeah, I, I've never done that before. I'm probably not going to mess around with it. But um, basically the thing needs power, and I don't really like that about it because... If I was gonna power, if I was gonna power a retriever, I would do it with sunlight. And if I have access to sunlight, why not just put solar panels up on site? You know, uh, so I don't really think that's a really good system. But Mordecai was bringing up that we could probably have golems take them out and put them in from the yep. bottom. So golems or even just normal gates, I think. Okay, so there you go. So that's what that's what I'm gonna be working on eventually at some point. Um, I don't even know if I'm gonna need it for this world, but I'm thinking about it in future worlds. Um, so I'll probably do it as more of a of a test. So, do you have a aqueous accumulator crafting thing? Uh, pretty sure I do. I should have made one of those. I, I didn't think that. I didn't realize I would need so many of them. I, I have six in my system if you want. <laughs> oh, okay, great, thanks. Just need. Two. I don't use them anymore. Just to make. Yes, yeah, I, I saw you were you were doing. Yeah, I should probably do that, but I don't. I don't really care about making the perfect build because there'll be future worlds. There will be multiplayer season 13 and there will be single player season 7. So, eh, I could just improve on it. And the next time I do a boiler setup, I will do the tank thing that you did. It's pretty cool. Uh, this is like my fourth iteration of, of this build, I think. Oh, well, that's what's cool about Minecraft. It uh, just gets better and better every time you do it. And that's not even a feed the beast thing. That's a Minecraft thing. If only the same was for Thomcraft. Thomcraft is a sucks. I, I don't like Thomcraft. Um, I love what I, I, like I get. It. I love what I get from it, and I will continue to do it. But my God, I hate doing it. <laughs> Freaking hate it. Yeah, love the items, I, hate the implementation. The only thing I don't like is designing room for it. The only thing I don't like about the whole thing. Actually, I like the I, I like the designing the room part. That's actually pretty cool because of the way it works twelve blocks out from the middle. It, it's it it makes for a very different build than anything else you would build. Like you don't usually put something in the center of a room and have walls around it holding everything it does. Um, I guess yeah, my I'm looking it. I'm looking at my boiler room right now and I do have boilers off centered in the room going to walls, but it's not the very center of the room. So I like Farmcraft rooms because it's not a setup that you'll see in. I, I won't set anything else up like that that I build. So but I want to give it. I want to give the room like a magic feel, and that's that's what I find hard. Because I always build like industrial. Well, just make it a little bit industrial, a little bit magic. It'd be like a steampunk thing, because that's not worn out. Yeah, I could run like actual pipes of steam through it. Ah, oh, this roof. I'll see. I wanted to make like a really dark church to counter um, Tom's church. <laughs> I have an inverted cross in there somewhere. Um. Alright, there we go. Water. Alright, so now we need the liquid. Ooh, that's, that's a pain in the butt. You can't run liquid through a uh, AE system, so I'm actually gonna have to have pipes coming down to this bad boy. Where, the 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 biofuel coming in does it have to be attached to the the bottom part of the steam boiler? Yes. It does. Okay. So like I could probably do it underneath actually. Yeah. 
It is remember. is one ingoing good enough? Water? Yeah. No, one. Just one pipe going in from the bottom. Will that be, give it all it needs? No, you need water too, right? No, no, I water have the water. water. The water's already done. I'm talking about the the biofuel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. okay. I didn't know if like you would need multiple to give it enough, you know? I have I have one line feeding three borders right now. One oh. product line. Alright. Alright, so I need a valve here. Which I don't have, I'm sure. I never have anything I need. So also uh today I got a chair for my uh, computer chair, so I'm much more comfortable, which is nice, because a lot of times I don't even want to come in here because my chair sucked. It was really old and just, you know, suck. You but. never realize how big a difference it makes until you're sitting in that new chair full-time. You're like, oh my god. I just want to be able to lean back. Like, my other chair uh, broke, so I couldn't lean back. It still worked. Like, I could sit in it, but I just couldn't lean back. And, like, leaning back is very comfortable. <laughs> <laughs> so... Yeah, if you can't lean back, you know. And then Autumn's like, oh, I can't wait to get your chair. I was like, really? My chair sucks. But I guess it's better than the chair she has. So I can't even sit in the chair that doesn't lean back anymore. It hurts my back now. I wonder if I should put the blocks back or just put them back as cobblestone to give Daryl a heart attack. I was pretty happy with what you did to his tower too. <laughs> oh yeah. It's not sad. It's not that bad. Like it's just a little bit. I mean, it sucks, but there's nothing I can do about it. Believe me, if there was, I would. Ooh, I'm gonna have just enough. Sweet! Of course, I'm in this stupid lever next to it. I hate that. The fuck was that? Who put a totem on top of a tree? He's a weirdo. Oh, I found Fonz's place. Burn it down. Oh, here, I knew I heard something. <laughs> hey, get me, Cage. Get classy. Classy, my ass. You see this tux I'm supporting? Exactly. You mean sporting? No, I'm supporting. You're supporting the tux? I'm holding it. That's I'm awful nice of you. The classiness. It reminds me of an episode of The Office. I've been watching a lot of Office lately. That Office there is a pretty good show. Oh, it's fucking hilarious. It's one of the funny... It's like the funniest show I've seen since The Simpsons. Why do we not have a biome that just borders a bunch of other biomes here? Yeah, get on that. We need a biome that borders other biomes. Shut up. Duh. <laughs> Why don't we have that? <laughs> I'm looking for a biome to do my bees in. I could make you one though. That's the funny thing. Yeah, make them a bee biome. How would you even do that? Mistcraft age. Mordecai does that shit. Oh. Yeah, but that's Mistcraft. We only want the one age. No. I mean, I don't know. We might be able to... I don't think we only want one age. We just don't want people making bunch of ages. Holes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I, don't 
We don't want Bemmer making like 20 ages. Yeah, we don't want Bemmer in charge of anything. Just. <laughs> Thanks for that, by the way, Bemmer. Power. Giving me a heart attack when I booted up my server. Being a full hard drive. <laughs> Alright, go biofuel! Oh, yeah! It was you and Geo, I think, right? Yeah. Geo was like, what do these pages do? I don't know. Well, what do they do? I don't know. Let's dope around with it. Okay. Where's he been? Was he on yesterday? Did I play Left 4 Dead with him, or was that just lazy? No. That was... That lazy. was Teddy Bear. Okay. He's still in the channel, which is pretty odd. Who, Teddy Bear? Yeah. yeah. What, what the f What is with that stupid goddamn name, anyway? Uh, I think he might start calling him that, and they're telling it as a joke, and he... I like just that? think he needs a hug. <laughs> yeah, and then... What's funny is when Autumn, Daryl, uh, and I were Googling people's names, I Googled Lazy, and literally a teddy bear came up. Well, the thing about people making fun of you is if you join in the joke, it takes away all their power. So, Lazy's a genius. <laughs> An annoying yeah. one. Don't be jelly that he's genius. Yeah, Marty Jelly. jelly. So, yeah, what, like so what am I supposed to do now in this game? I've done everything. Like, what's next? Help the system. All right. Maybe I'll make okay. a maybe I'll make a public boiler for anyone to use as long as they have a a tesseract. Do you have that? It's called help. You, just, you yeah. just build a help center. Yeah. You just stand in there. Hey, do I need help? We need help with help with everything. Sorry. Have you ever done bees, Gage? No. Uh. Not, I don't really know why anyone would do them. I mean, like, what are um, they gonna do? What do they do have for you? Have you never, never played Pokemon? Might be a stupid question. It's, I don't. Uh, can I have them fight for me? No, but it's basically the same thing, but the collecting and. Uh, one sec, I'll be right back. Maybe. Maybe. Wall. Maybe if I could have them fight other people's bees, that would be cool. A bee stadium. I don't know about that. E badges. So for you guys watching the videos, um, I don't know if I showed you how I set this up. I'm, I'm pretty sure I did, but just in case I didn't. The fermenter runs off water, but it runs better off apple juice. So since my apple juice thing's full, I'm going to turn off the water. Turn And this lever right here turns on the apple juice. And as soon as the water is out of this, it will start running off apple juice. And uh, it'll run better. You'll get more per oak sapling. Pretty sure I did explain that, but I'm just going to explain it again. All right, what are we gonna do with all this power? Let's uh, let's set up like five quarries or something. I don't know. Let's see how many diamonds we have. Uh, we only have three hundred diamonds. That's that's not gonna do. Uh, Ten thousand iron. Only a thousand copper. It's pretty weak sauce. Um, let's see. Yeah, we should probably set up another quarry. I should do something with this room. Somebody messed up this room badly. I don't even know why there's a thing going down there. Stupid people. I'm covering this up right now. Let's grab some food. Put some cans back. See, I don't like this thing, but I didn't mean this to be like this. Uh, yeah, you know what? I should probably build it. All right, let's 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 do some building. Where's, where's my basalt? Oh, I love this. Like, one point. What is this? 5.4.7. Skeletons can't even hit me. Hodging it. I'm not stay in this, not go to 1.5, ever. I'm never excited for updates. Um, sometimes it's good to update, like, not even update, but move on to something else. Like, I am glad I left Tekkit and went to Feed the Beast, and I didn't want to do that. But most of the time it just sucks. No, well, I do want the horses, though. Eh, I mess around horses, they're nothing special. Although, I will name a horse Daryl. Donkey. <laughs> There's donkeys too. There. Did you ever watch that episode of my single player world? When I was playing Technic? 
and I had I had a horse named Daryl, and I was like, all like, okay, Daryl, let's go for a ride. And I was like, whoa, Daryl, whoa. And like, just, I just saw it on stream, Daryl and Lord Terror. Right? Yeah, the Lord Terror one I did on stream. But yeah, it was pretty funny. I had a good time with that. So maybe horses will be a good idea. All right, guys, so that's my timer. So that's going to be it for part 27, and we'll see you next time for part 28. Until then, take it easy. Bye-bye.